Megan knows you've had a stroke? Of course she has to know. I'm taking it from that that she hasn't called you? No. No phone call? No. How long has it been now? It's been four years. So just radio silence? Exactly. So, Russell, uh, if... I mean, look, none of us want to get in the middle of the family dynamic here between uh, you know, father and daughter, but it's pretty rough when you're not willing to ring your dad even after having a stroke. Well, I don't think there's any room in the middle of it because there's an awful lot of the Markles speaking out. I mean, we've had Thomas himself, um, who didn't look well in that interview. I mean, I think our hearts do go out to him. He certainly didn't um, look as though he, he's a well man. I mean, we has, Megan hasn't been speaking to him in recent months. You've, of course, got Samantha and Thomas Jr. speaking out as well. And I think had Megan come here, it would have not only been a huge, huge distraction for the main event, because how would have the family have dealt with her? How would have the media have dealt with her? 